So now we've imported our bill of material information. Uh, you can see I've clicked on the view source bomb up here and it shows me it all here. Now we're ready to start applying it to every place that it's used here. So I'm just going to pick them at random here. So let's say you're going to replenish the mold material. You just double click, brings it up. You select the row mold material. You can see how much we get left here. We can say we're using another four here. We click on the OK and we close out of this and it's going to put that in here. So maybe you go to uh, over here, secure four screws. You click on this, you're going to go to your screws. You click on the select here. You've got 20 available. We're going to use four here and click on the OK and then close out of that and it starts to do it here. Get the casing. So let's imagine double click here. We'll just pick it at random here. I'm not looking for a specific casing. So let's just look at this uh, here. And you can see there's two available here. We'll say two. Click on the OK. If there's other items going at that point in time, maybe a couple of screws, we could apply them here. Let's say they're attached with four screws. So we can do that. Notice the screws have been, uh, the number of screws available has been reduced as I make the selection here. That's going to apply this casing. So we get two items on there. And we close out of this here. So you can see if I hover over these, just with my mouse, it's bringing up the listing of the parts that are used in the particular uh, activities that are involved here. So you can go to the funnel here, you pick another one, the same here. Let's see, now I'm going to pick one of these guys here. Let's say I pick this one here. There's only a quantity of one here. You click on it. Notice it automatically puts in the one here. Because obviously when there's only one, you've got no choice. You either take it or you don't. If you don't want it, you close it. If you, if you do want it, you just click on the OK. It's just a little bit of a uh, ease of use, so we say, in letting you pick the different items you're looking for here. So what you're doing is you're building up the uh, parts that are associated with each of the activities in your process here.